Hi, welcome back to Culture Share. Our next artist has come from Barbados. He grew up in a singing family and in the early 60s he had two big hits. One was called I Love You and the other Police is the Nurse's Choice. He continued singing and touring and in the early 80s he had another two hits, Hazel and Shining Star. Lord Sivers has continued to tour the world. He has made numerous appearances and has appeared with some of the top recording stars. I want you to welcome Lord Sivers on our program and let us pick it up at an interview that we did while we were at Soka Village a couple months ago. You're one of a growing number of Caribbean stars who have had the opportunity of performing on the stage of the world famous Apollo Theatre. Who are some of the stars you've performed there with? Well, <laughs> don't we go back a while now I go back with um, Sly and the Family Stones, the Mama and the Papas. <laughs> You know, um, I had a tour with Brooke Benton. I, matter of fact, I came to this country with Joe Tex. Mm -hmm. And I've done a number of performances on the play. What about overseas? What have you done? Oh, well, Europe, mm -hmm. we've been all over Antwerp, Belgium, Amsterdam and Rotterdam, Holland, Liverpool. What about the appearances, radio, television? Yes, I've done a couple of those shows, but um, recently, what I've been doing most is trying to get the soak row. And I'm so happy to be on this show because this is what we need, you know, to expose the soak music. No doubt, and we welcome you to Culture Share. You began singing way back in the 1960s. We're into the 90s now. We're looking at almost three decades, mm -hmm. 30 years. What has kept you going over those years? Just what I'm doing. I love the music. I can't stop. <laughs> Look 
out of Barbados with a wonderful performance there for you on Culture Share. Well, our next star on the show hails from St. Vincent. He has had tunes such as Vincy Woman, Sweet and Nice, Ouch, The Lobster, etc. I'm talking about Ziggy and I want to tell you now, after Ziggy, we're going to go to Little Pinky and after Little Pinky, we're going to be having Patrick Dells. But that's another story. I just want you to stay tuned because we were expecting them on the program this afternoon. First, let's pick up the videotape with Ziggy where we were talking about his performances and his career. You started with a band way back when, since St. Saint Vincent. I mean, how did that prepare you for what you're doing today? Roland Sardine, I would say, is responsible for my, my being in music today. Yeah, he's, he, I, he had a small band that they call the Green Sleeves Combo. So I started hanging around playing cowbell, played a little bongo here, little congas. Then eventually I was elevated to drums. Started to play the drums, went to the Virgin Islands, stayed there for like five years, playing drums and singing. I started to sing Calypso in 1974. Would you regret it or you would say it's been a great 16 years? Great. It has been great for me. Let's say it one more time for Ziggy, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>
man She creates affection What a silly confusion Oh, oh What a healthy, healthy sight She is really dynamite Full of trust and sweet cooking I love style of sword cooking She had the whole of tongue so spellbound Oh, oh So they call she the lobster All we need can be fair We got good look at the lobster performances from Barbados, from Trinidad and from St. Vincent.